Everyone, it is Dustin again with my home kit home back again with another one for you. You know, we've all seen the marketing fluff 16 million colors. It doesn't matter if it's this guy or if it's this guy, or if it's one of these light strips here in the back, or if it's that Philips Hue bloom behind the television there. They all claim to be able to give us a range of 16 million colors, which is great and all. I am a little bit skeptical, especially considering that the human eye is really only capable of seeing between 7 and 10 million colors on average. However, I'm sure they're using some sort of color metering system that allows them to come up with this idea. Either way, we can probably all agree that we're not taking full advantage of the 16 million colors that we have at our disposal. And regardless of the quality of the light or the manufacturer, pretty much these are all the same colors, although their saturation and their brightness as well as their hue may vary slightly. But one thing we can be assured of, regardless of the manufacturer, is that our friend Siri can actually help us with these colors. And I'm not just talking about our standard Roy G Biv colors. I'm also not talking about bright green or bright yellow or or even sienna or burnt orange or goldenrod. No, I'm talking about some pretty unique colors that Siri is capable of recognizing. So what we'll do in this video is I've collected more than 50 shades of Siri, let's say, and we'll go through them and we'll kind of see how they look. Now, one of the things that I do want to mention is that the color representation in video isn't exactly accurate, but you'll get an idea of the colors that Siri is capable of recognizing. And I'll link down in the description box where I found my ideas. But I just wanted to choose a few different ones that I find particularly interesting. So without further ado, let's start off strong. Hey, Siri. Turn the lights in the living room to peach puff. Got it.
there it is folks, more than 50 shades that Siri is capable of recognizing. Some of them may be a little bit on the kind of stranger side, things like Fuzzy Wuzzy and, and you know, Atomic Tangerine, Mango Tango, Banana Mania, some of those, which I really like. Um, and then some of them are more kind of you know, obscure outer space, shadow, these sorts of things. They're really kind of fun to play around with. Say for example, it's raining outside and you have the storm cloud color scene kind of set up in HomeKit. You can also use your HomePod and Siri shortcuts to play a playlist that has some different songs that you might like or even some rain sounds to kind of reinforce the rain. But I'm sure you guys have plenty of ideas on how you can actually use these particular light colors using Siri. And I'd like to hear from you in the comments down below. Also, if you have any unique colors that you like to use with Siri, let us know down in the comments as well. Also down below in the description box, you'll find links to the lists of the more exhaustive colors that Siri is capable of recognizing, as well as the blog over at myhomekithome.com. Also in the description box, you'll find links to all of our social media where we regularly update with different HomeKit news different product announcements, different updates, and things like that, all related to HomeKit. So check us out at My HomeKit Home. As always, if you found the video useful, give us a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already and the bell notification so you don't miss any of our new videos as soon as they're released. Well, that about wraps it up for this video. I do thank you for watching. And until next time, this has been Dustin with My HomeKit Home.